Hey guys, Brian with WorkshopAddict.com and I've been doing a little work with LED lights trying to brighten up some pretty dark places that we have and I ran across a little different light that I'm not sure everyone's going to be into but I know that there is quite a few of you that are going to be very excited about this. Well, I can't pronounce the name. I believe it's on for you. This hanging LED light is basically the same as the deformables that we went through before, but it has a lot of cool features that the other light maybe didn't have just perfect, and this is the same price. So this LED light here is meant to hang. It does have a power cord, so you don't need a socket, which is a plus and or a minus here. It is all powder coated white. It is a 100 watt light, 11,000 lumens with a 5K color temperature. And you can see that the covering that is plastic over top of the LED light is not clear. So it helps to push that light around a little bit and it allows you to move these guys where you need them, how you need them. I love it. It does have a safety strap so you could give it a secondary hanging feature in case your first one lets loose, which I guess it's going to depend on where you hang it. My goal here is mostly to just get our shop in order as far as working. So we went through deer season. It was great to have the lights, but we found that where we're working in a corner, we don't have the greatest light. And that's led me to where our lift is. And there's great lighting in here. In fact, I walked around before it again with my Lux meter, that app, and it's crazy. I got a average of 474 with a low of 263. That's obviously closer to the tractor in a high of 714. Is the app accurate? I don't know. We're just using it as a baseline. And then I installed this light that I have behind me kind of in the center, very temporarily. And we'll turn it on here. Then I can walk through and I got a low of 398, of course that's close down to the tractor, a high of 1369 and an 870 average. Takes that side and completely lights it up so you can work on anything on the motor. You're not pulling out another LED light that's sitting there. It's awesome and it was easy. It's not the prettiest at this point, but it was something that's easy to hang. So think about this you're out fishing and you have set up a place to fillet your fish and it's underneath the tent. You don't have enough light. You simply hang one of these guys up, run an extension cord to it, camping, hunting. You're in someone else's garage. You're skinning a deer. Their garage isn't lit really well. Boom. This is cake. Or you can permanently mount it up there per se and just run this cord to it. Now in our case, we have a workbench in the other shop that is not used often, but when it's used, it's absolutely horrible. It's dark, dim, even with the other lights, you're kind of casting a shadow over top because you are again in a corner, two foot from a wall. In that case, I'm gonna try to buy a, it's a light outlet that has a pull chain and it has a plug in it. Now you need to have a three prong plug. So, I'll link to it in the description. It's going to be cool because I can leave that pull chain pulled, plug this dude into it, run it over, and then when I turn on the light switch, that light and this light will turn on at the same time, giving me a ton of light directly over top of the workbench. I can hang it a little bit lower off the ceiling. Works great. I know, man, this is one of those things where you go, okay, where do I stop with lighting? And, and that's purely where it's at. Most of us have garages that aren't lit well. We have a workbench in there. Do you want to go up, tear through the insulation, and install a new light? You don't have to. It may not be as pretty. You're going to have to get something to hide the cords that you're going through here. But at the same point, you can hang it. You can hang it lower. You can hang it on the ceiling. You can do anything you want very simply. So currently, I picked up two of these. $49.99 a piece on Amazon. They say they have a warranty. You know how Amazon is. And with the name, the on for you, uh, it's made in China. There is no doubt there. Things that stuck out to me that I really liked about it. Again, 5K, not 6K. Not that it matters. The 6K didn't matter to me and it worked great for where we're at. 
kind of a diffused LED light panel, which is nice. It's plastic. I liked, you can unscrew it, take it off, but it, it needs to be on there. That is what it is. The white that's up here is a nice cast. Works, looks great. It comes with a Allen key, so you can tighten up these guys if you wanted to. I would be careful of that. I'm looking at the lock washer that's in there already. I wouldn't go too tight. Uh, they seem pretty good where they're at, but if it came loose, you could always tighten it up. This cable comes off with a little screw, no big deal. Well worth looking at if you need something in a different place where you wanna hang it. In this case, where I'm gonna, I'm just gonna hang it on this side. I got the one behind me. If I could put one directly over me, that would give me light both sides of the lift. It would, obviously according to our Lux meter, it will dang near double the amount of light that we have in the area of the lift for a hundred bucks. Simple. I love it. I think you will too. Links are in the description as normal. Guys, appreciate your time. Give us a like in this video, subscribe to the channel. As always, have a great day.